My name is Faith Winthrop. This is the 10th of February 2022 and this is a recording of a fitness program for the sea turtle number one. All right, Toby. Okay. So we're going to get straight into it. All right, so a program, a 100 metre jog as the start of our warm up, but just for the sake of the video, I'll just get you to jog to the trampoline and All back. Right. Jogging. Yep. Good job. Yep, 50 metres. And we come back around. <laughs> yeah. Done. Yeah. Okay, young Toby, we're going to do some. Some high knees. Yep. Yep. Raise those knees, Toby. <laughs> All right, you're 17, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to you a bit younger. Than not, you know? Okay. Better not vomit. Yep, good job. We've got star jumps. So about 30 seconds of these. We'll just I'll tell you when to stop, keep going. Yeah, that was a good 30 seconds. And then we'll just do some trunk twists. So like that, and we're just doing opposite hand to opposite foot, just to warm up full body. Yeah. <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> you make me laugh. I'm trying to be serious. Okay. Yeah. Good job. So, the first, the first thing we're doing is a deadlift. So, because you wanted to get big muscles, you want to increase your muscles. So, for the deadlift, it's good for ha your hammies, your glutes. Your back and hips, your core, and your traps. So it's basically pretty good overall. I'm going to do use a kettlebell. Usually use a barbell, but you, know, you can alternate with anything. So you have your um, feet shoulder width apart. You're hinging at the hips, slightly bent knees, and then you're not not squatting to come yeah. up. You're hinging, to come up, a straight right. back. Try and keep like a neutral spine the whole way, so don't hunch over. I probably should have warmed back. In the program, I've got about two to three kilos, but this one is a five. So I will get you to, we're going to do two, two lots of eight. So I'll get you to do eight of those. Yep. And then we'll just have like 30 second rest. Yep. Eight more. And then in the program, I've got three lots of six of a higher weight. Yeah. But we can just keep it at five. Yeah, keep it yeah, five. Yeah. But just for the um, sake of like so building muscles. Bent, like, yeah. Back hinged. Yep. Yep. Oh, that's so slow on the way down and then fast coming up. And as you're coming down, <laughs> you go slow and it helps build those muscles. Yep. Good job. We have four, five, six, seven, one more, eight. <laughs> Right. Awesome. So we'll just say you've done the two lots of eight. Um, now we're going to do three lots of six in the program for that. For the sake of video, we'll just do one lot of six and I'd move it up a higher weight. But are you happy? No, I'm happy with yeah, that. Yeah, we'll just add that. We'll keep the three kilos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then I'll just get you to do a lot of six. So yeah. the higher the weight is, the less reps you do. Yeah. Um, especially for like strength, endurance, and just yep. to build muscle. Yeah. Yeah. Because obviously, the more the more intensity is, the less you can do it for. Yeah. Yeah. So right. yeah, when you're ready. So it's bent and hinge. Yeah. Yeah. Try not to bend your arms when you come up. Keep them straight. Yeah. Well, that's hard. Isn't it? Yeah. It's pretty. It's good for overall. <laughs> See, I'm just lifting it. That's I must. I must improve my glutes. You're doing. You're doing good. It's great for the glutes. <laughs> Six, I think. Yeah, that'll do. Well done. <laughs> awesome. Okay, so now we're going to do, I've got three rounds of eight reps. We'll just do the one round of eight reps. So. I no. oh, so that was just, she's still recording. Yeah. So, we've just got, now let me know if anything doesn't work and I can modify it for the effect. So, we've got a goblet squat all the way down. Ooh, and that might hurt. And these are good for your quads and your glutes, pushing through your heels as you come up and try and keep a neutral spine not to hunch over nice. as you come down. Yep, a resist, upright resistance, sorry. Resistance row, so just have your feet out like, like that. Sorry, stand up tall. Like a little chicken wing arms. Yep. Yeah. That's my muscle, I must improve my lats. 
Yeah, that's excellent for muscle growth and good for your bones as well. Yeah. Um, we've got push-ups, good for your triceps, shoulders, pecs, upper and your lower body. Now, if it's too, if you can't get enough depth and it's too much on your feet, knees are fine. Yeah. Yep. And then we've got calf raises, and I've got it with a five kilo. So obviously for the calves. So we just uh, yeah. Easy. try not to rush it, just go slow because we are trying to move build muscle. So when, when you're doing exercises and you're trying to build muscle, the slower you do it, yeah. the better it is. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we've got. We'll just do one round of eight, and then I'll remind you and All correct right. you. Three. I'm going to think so the goblet squat. Yep. So these will be your. Oh, I can't get right there. That's now. all right. That's fine. <laughs> you can just do your half squat if you like for the sake of the video. Um, so these are good for your quad, quads and your glutes, but obviously you're still using the muscles in your arms yep. to hold, that, hold up. that up. And then you've got that extra bit of weight. So four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. And then we've got the resistance band row, like the little chicken arms. Chicken wings. So. Yeah. Yeah. That I can do. You feel that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. So you don't necessarily need weight. No. So anyone can basically do this. This would be good to travel with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, eight. And we've got eight push ups. Everyone's favourite. I'm doing it on my knees because it'll hurt me back. That's fine. Um, try and uh, remember to you breathe out on the effort. So, <laughs> so on the way back up. Yep. So think, just think whichever part is hardest for you, you just breathe out. <laughs> A lot of people hold their breath. <laughs> yeah, I can't do it. Doing well. Eight. Well done. Yay. And then the, <laughs> the calf raises. So it also requires a bit of balance. That's with the bell. Yep. Yep. Ooh. So what was then? Two. Right. <laughs> Three. Four. Five. Six. Two more. Seven. <laughs> eight. Excellent. Okay, so now you're Tara. Okay. <laughs> We're doing the second half of another one. And you are trying to increase, increase your hitting power and your sprint speed. So, you're also 13 years of age. <laughs> so, I've got, I've got five rounds of 20 meter sprints. I'll, we'll just do it once. So, I'll get you to sprint. Oh, you're going to faster, that. just stop it. But, one second, we're going to start like this. Yeah. <laughs> we're pushing off the back foot, so I'll say, on your marks, get set, go, and then push. Right. We're just doing that once. On your marks. Okay, get out the way. Yeah. Right. Let me move this for you, see that. Get set, go. <laughs> you go, Tara! <laughs> Well done. So for the sake of the video, like I said, we'll just do that once. That will help. It's, for, it's good for explosive power, so it will yeah. help in, when you're playing hockey. <laughs> for your sudden sprints. Okay, so we've got three rounds of six reps of a little circuit. which usually is like a lot of wooden box or which is usually quite high. But we'll just do these. If the box would jump to make you nervous, I'm happy for you to do like a step. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, or them. and then step down. Yeah. So we've got box jumps and then medicine ball slam. All that is is 
beat the kids out of it. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. It's a four kilo one, so it's not too heavy. For the sake of Tara, Huggies, two kilo one. She's 13 <laughs> years of age. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we'll do six reps of that. And then I've got the resistance row upright, which is the one we did before. Yeah. Um, I'll do the same thing. Yep, yeah, so we'll do the. I'll get you to do the lesson ball here. Then you can come back over here. <laughs> and then the last one for that is my favourite, so jump squat. Right, eh? Like a little froggy? Yeah! <laughs> All of this is good for explosive power. Right. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's it. Okay, so we'll, we'll do one round of six reps. Yeah. And so take at your own pace. Okay, yeah. ready. Right, ready, set, go. So we've got six ball jumps. One, two, three, four, <laughs> oh, <I'm not>. six. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's right. So now we've got the medicine ball slam. So if you want to come over here. And so you throw that at the ball as, out of the ground as hard as you can. <laughs> yep. That would be excellent for when you're um, smashing that hockey. That was fun. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the resistance band up row, so you might have to put your feet a little bit wider. Yep. That's both hands? Yep. Yep, one, two, three, four, five, six. Good job. And then the jump squats. So the... Froggies. Yep, the frogs. <laughs> <laughs> Frog jumps. Yep. So this will help will decrease the chances of injury. Yeah. This gets your heart beat back to a normal state. Good. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want that injury, okay? So we've got a hundred meter walk. I'll just get you to yeah, walk walk around. Yeah, not too fast because we're not warm up, we're cooling down. <laughs> Doing good, Tara. <laughs> All right. Now we'll just do some stretches. Now I've got a quad stretch, oh, quad stretch, tricep stretch, and just three two toes. So quad stretch is this one. If you want to hold on to something, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, so I've just, I'll give that a few seconds. I'll put my timer on. Yeah, swap these. Ooh, you feel that stretching. Mm. Mm. We've got the tricep stretch, so yeah. that's just stretching, obviously, your tricep in there. Yeah. And then just the toe touch. Oh, reach for your toes. If that's a bit much. Oh, no, you guys can say touch your ankles. We'll I can't reach them now, so. Yeah. Yeah. It's bum crack. <laughs> Um, and then I'll just do a shoulder one as well. Yep. Yeah, like sorry. Arm cross. Yeah. Yeah. You feel that stretch. Definitely. Probably worth me doing these before I do work. Yeah, well, so dynamic stretches are when you're moving ones. Yeah. Yeah, so once you do before, warm up, sort of like how people do star jumps. Yeah. Um, basically just body weight movements, just not too much. Yeah. And the static stretches are good for what you have after exercise, which is your holding ones. Yeah. 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 So it does make a difference. Whereas, um, yeah, good job, Tara. Well done, <laughs> well done, Dave.